few minutes ago, there was uh, tear gas canisters going off in this crowd. There's still a catch in the throat and a sting in the eye. But right now, an uneasy standoff between the riot police on this side and the crowd on the other. If anything, the tear gas seems to have made the crowd angrier, though. There's crowds stretching all the way down Gloucester Road in that direction, all the way up and onto the overpasses, all the way around on the cross streets as well. And they're shouting, power to the people, put down your weapons, police go on strike, we have no fear. And some of them have been telling me that they are determined uh, to stick this out to what they call the end. They're saying they're not going to move until they get what they what they want. Hugo here is 21 years old, is a salesman. Good evening, Hugo. How long have you been here? I've been here for my third night. This is your third night this here? This is third night, yeah. yeah. And why are you here? What does it mean to you? Oh, because tonight is meant for our whole Hong Kong's future. We have to stand here because we are a part of the Hong Kong. And if not, I can't imagine how our future will be. So the Hong Kong government, the Chinese government, have appealed to everybody to go home. Uh, the government in China obviously saying that these democracy protests are being whipped up by foreign hostile forces who want to undermine the stability and prosperity of Hong Kong and want to subvert China. But at this point tonight, you can only say that this crowd is not listening.